guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm gonna go ahead and do something I haven't done in a while, and that's just a, you know, neutral kind of like eye tutorial. A few of you have wanted me to go ahead and do some of these because you love my natural looks or neutral looks, neutral and natural, two different things, Jennifer, I know. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how I did this one today. And basically what it is, it's just a kind of like champagne, brown, smoky eye. It's really easy to do, and it's perfect for all occasions, in my personal opinion. Like, I would totally wear this out going grocery shopping. I would wear this out at the club. I would wear this out every day, all day. It's just kind of like a very versatile look and that's absolutely why I love it. So if you guys are interested in how I put this look together, just keep watching. We're gonna go ahead and kick off this look by laying down a primer and I'll be using this one by Urban Decay. But if you're looking for a cheaper alternative, definitely check out the one by e.l.f. To help give my shadows a little more oomph in the life, I'm gonna go ahead and lay down a nice cream base and this is an NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Sparkle Nude. And apply this just to my lid area and then blend it out to a sheer coverage with my fingers. Next, I'm going to be taking my all-time favorite eyeshadow, Sin by Urban Decay, and this is actually from the Ammo Palette, and it's just a pink champagne frosty color. And with an eyeshadow brush, just pat and sweep this color all over the cream base. From the Urban Decay Naked 2 Palette, I'm going to grab this light chocolatey cocoa color, and it's called Tease. Taking my handy dandy crease brush, we're going to go ahead and apply Tease directly into our crease and just build up that color a little bit and then work it up towards our brown bone and then just kind of blend that little bad boy out just a tad to create a really subtle transition. Again with the Naked 2 palette, we pick up a little bit of Foxy with a nice fluffy brush. We're going to go ahead and lay her down on her brow bone just to give us a nice highlight. Next, I'm going to go ahead and pick up a little bit of smog from my Urban Decay Ammo Palette. And for a little added drama and dimension, pop this color right into the crease as well. Take a clean fluffy brush and blend out any harsh lines. Using this vanilla eyeshadow from my Philosophy Palette, then I'm going to snack this sucker on top of my brow bone just to intensify my highlight. Just to make sure the look comes together seamlessly, apply a little more smog on the outer corner and blend it into sin. Next, I'm going to be taking this really shimmery white eyeshadow and it's Polyester Bride, again from the Ammo Palette from Urban Decay. And with the same fancy smancy eyeshadow brush, I'll be applying this bad boy to my inner corner and lower lash line. So now that we're finished with the top part of the eyes, I'm going to go ahead and apply my liquid liner. I do have a tutorial and the link will be down below. Then I'm going to tightline my upper waterline with my Urban Decay 24-7 pencil in zero. Next, I'm going to add about one to two coats of mascara. And lastly, this part is completely optional, it's all about preference, but I'll be applying my favorite lashes of all time, and they are Demi Wispies by Salon Perfect. And the lash glue that I am going to be using is this crappy one, and it's called Lash Grip Eyelash Adhesive. After I'm done applying all those things, I'm going to line my lower waterline with a black pencil, and I'd like to do this just to make my eyes look a little more almond and less owl. And to help keep the liner from smudging and smearing and moving all over the place, I'll be setting it with just an ordinary black eyeshadow. Using this deep dark brown chocolatey color from the same philosophy palette, with a super tiny baby eyeshadow brush, I'm going to smoke out my bottom lash line just a bit. Grabbing a little bit of tease, I'm going to place this color directly in the middle of my lower lash line. Then in the inner corner and lower lash line, just apply a little bit of sin. Of course, your baby lashes deserve a little love too, so feel free to add a couple coats of mascara to those little guys as well. So that wraps it up for the eyes part of this tutorial. If you are wondering what I did with my face, it's just kind of my everyday foundation contouring and highlighting routine. I've already done a video on this, so I'll have that linked down below for you guys that are interested. And then also for my lips, I went for something a little more neutral as well, and I'm just using this kind of pinky color. You can never go wrong with this lipstick. It matches literally almost every makeup look. It's called Snob, and it is by Matt. So that about wraps it up for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and I will catch you guys on the flip side. Bye.